Hello everybody. Today I want to share about what is different between will and going to. Okay, what is different between will and going to? So let's get started. Going to is used with predictions. Yes, going to is used with predictions. When you are making a decision, use will. Use going to after the decisions has been made. We sometimes also use the present continuous for plan events in the near future. When we want to talk about future facts or things we believe to be true about the future, we use will. Okay, when to use will or going to? When you're talking about actions that you will do soon, tomorrow or next week, use going to. When you want to ask or request for something, use will. When you expect things, Anticipating something to happen, use going to. Finally, when you promise something, use will. Will and go into examples. Example, I think I'll go to that party next week. I'll think I'll go into that party next week. The economy will get better soon. Yes, I will marry you. Will and going to the same. Will is used to express future actions. Besides, at the moment of speaking, while going to describe future plans, decide before the moment of speaking. What is will and be going to? Will is often used to a, sm to a similar way to be to be going to will is used when we are talking about something with uh, absolute certainty be going to is used when used when we want to exercise our decide decisions or the environment uh, this and the uh, evidence evidence in the present what is another word for going to preparing retiring living withdrawing Adjourning, departing, going, proceeding, tran transferring, existing. How do you use will? We use will to express belief about the pre the presence or future to talk about what people want to do or are willing to do to make 
from its offers and requests. And so we use will. Because it is a past tense, it is used. Number one, to talk about the past. And number two, to talk about hypothesis. Hypothesis. When we imagine something. Number three, for politeness. 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 For politeness. What do you use going to in a sentence? We have the form subject plus be verb plus going and plus infinitive. So we have five, yeah, we have five examples to uh, explain or to show about show about going to I am going to finish my report tonight I am going to finish my report tonight she is going to do some research this afternoon she is going to some research this afternoon Tim Tim said that he is going to listen to some to some live music tonight Number four They are going to to bake a cake for her birthday They are going to take a cake to bake a cake for her birthday. Number five, we are going to war to wait and see what happened before we make a decisions. So we'll be going to will we'll be going meaning. I will go in place the impassive for the future but gives a hazy not quite here yet and could be alert 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 alter in presence something might prevent you after all however I am going is much stronger and plays the emphasis on commitment. I am going to means that nothing will stop you from going. Will is will is present tense. Will is present tense. Will is you for future. Yeah, will is useful the future. But also for the, the present. Many people consider will to be the, the present form. It's past form is root. And like all present forms, it can be used to talk about the, the present or future. Will go or will be going. He's be going to see his grandparents. This is a continued tense, so it refer to what he'll be doing at a specific time. For most future situations. It best to use going to unless it a uh, conditional if he behaves well today he's going to see his grandparents tomorrow will 
will gonna will gonna mean <coughs> sorry gonna is a construction construction contraction of going to and is considered to be colloquial English to be used in a f informal context more formal situations especially when wri writing call for either or either will or slightly less formally going to what a difference between watch and see yeah one more question and then we will finish this video see means to notice or become aware of someone or something by using your eyes look means to direct your eyes in a particular direction watch means to look at someone or something for an amount of time and pay attention to what is happening yeah finish for my this video i hope you enjoy this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel and open the notification to get more video from my channel goodbye and good luck for you love you all bye bye